All right, in this video, we're going to cover really briefly on how to remove permissions for third-party applications for Eve. And then after I show you how to do that, I will explain kind of why you'd want to do this, um, especially if you've been playing for a long time. The first thing you want to do is you want to go to community.eveonline.com and you want to log in with whatever character you want to check their permissions. And the website looks just like this. On the menu up here, we're going to go to support. We're going to go to third party applications. So right now we are logged in as Martan the miner. And you see here, Martan has permissions um, access given to Z Killboard and Eve Kill. So each one of these, we can go over and look at view permissions. And we can see exactly what ESI data we are allowing it to pull from our character. So Eve to Kill is getting public data. It's also getting ESI kill mail read for corporation kill mails. It's also getting read for regular key mails or kill mails. Now let's go over and look at Z kill board here. They're getting a, roughly the same thing. Read kill mails and then read corporation kill mails. And then also we're getting write fittings. That's where you can like push fittings to your, uh, your client essentially. So this is where you'd view all that stuff and what scopes each one each application is actually getting so it's it, removing them is as simple as just rolling over the application here or the delete application button and just removing it there we go now it's very very important that if you've been playing for a long time that you kind of keep up with this especially if you've been in big alliances that use uh websites that track your corporation members or at least your corporations because Things like Seat and a lot of those applications will track a lot of data, a lot of data. Um, and whenever you're actually giving authorization to these applications, look at the scope that they're trying to get to. A lot of websites that you have to join as a prerequisite to join an alliance are going to want pretty much everything. They're going to be able to see your email. They're going to be able to see who you're talking to on your email if you trade items with a player, those um, transactions show up in your transactions of your wallet. So they'd be able to see who you're trading with. They will be able to see your fittings. They'll be able to see your assets. They'll be able to see where your character is. They'll be able to see bookmarks, all kinds of stuff. So if you are not part of that alliance anymore, make sure you go in there and remove permissions because you might be just giving away free intel if you don't actually remove that stuff. But that's going to be it. Hopefully this video is helpful. Do an audit on all your characters, especially if you've been involved in bigger alliances and you're not anymore. Remove that stuff. There's no need to be giving out data that uh, is not relevant anymore. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Hit the Patreon. Check that out. And make sure you hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.